My name is Vito Scaletta. I was born in Sicily in 1925. That little guy's me. I'm standing there with my parents and my sister Francesca in front of our old house. I don't really remember too much about the old country, except that we were pretty hard up. And then one day my father decided it was time to move away. from Sicily, across the ocean, to start a new life in America. seen anything as fantastic as Empire Bay. It was beautiful. On the other hand, I'd never seen anything filthier, more disgusting than our new shithole of an apartment. The American Dream. It was more like a nightmare. My father started working at the port for the guy who arranged our immigration. It was backbreaking work. And what little money he made mostly went towards booze. Eventually my parents sent me to school. I had to learn English. I sure as hell wasn't going to do that in a neighborhood full of Italians. That's where I met Joe. Come on, Vito, hurry it up. We ain't got all night. Over time, Joe and I got to be best friends. And since we were both poor and there wasn't much work around, <sighs> shit, we started a little business of our own. Freeze! Police! Stop! Vito, this way! Throw me to bed! Stop! Run the shoot! Shit. Okay, you bastard. Spread your legs. Fuck. And put your hands on the fence. I'm sorry. Well, that one time it didn't work out so good. The year was 1943. America was at war. And the army was looking for guys who spoke the language to help with the invasion of Sicily. I was 18. And anything seemed better than jail. Who says you can't go home again? Operation Husky. I was assigned to the 504th Parachute Infantry. On the 11th of July, we were supposed to be dropped over the southern coast of Sicily. But we got hit by flak and had to bail out. Way behind enemy lines. Only three of us made it. If it wasn't for the local resistance, we wouldn't have had a chance. So when most of the soldiers came into the town and started rounding everybody up, we decided to return the fair. Se nessuno parla, quest'uomo morirà. Eh? No, no, eh? Per favore, no. No, no. Dicevo al mio amico di stare attento. Fregatene di fare attenzione, fai ciò che ti è stato detto! Un congetto quando si maretà come cucina. Ma chi è quello? Lo conoscete? Eh, lo conoscono tutti. Don Calò è un uomo d'onore. È uno stupido trucco degli americani, non ditemi che gli credete. No, è davvero Don Calò. Ogni tanto dovessi ascoltare i consigli di noiazzi del posto. Ci rendiamo. Sapete che potete affidarvi di me. Che le dite, eh? Don Calò, the head of the Sicilian mob. An entire garrison of troops surrendered that day. Why? 
because he told them to. <laughs>